Obviously, it feels good. Um, I think uh, all good films deserve uh, right kind of acclamation. In the particular film, is also in the part life, but I mean I know that the film is something extraordinary. I know that on the in the version of blue, there are some great films from uh, Indian Indian cinema. There are some outstanding films. This particular film has been selected. Na Kandipa, there is something unique which might appeal to the global audience, and then I'm sure that it's going to make it to the nominations. I mean, I, I think the film has a very good team also to push it further. So I wish them all the best to really make it to the nominations. One more question. Ipo, inna magliana Jonas Indian cinema la handi pana namlu Oscar nominate. No, no, it's not a genre specific thing. There is no specific genre. It's about the I feel it's about the finesse, like the, the the quality of the film. More, it's not about grandeur or it's not about uh, ethnicity or reality. Abhi yedu me we cannot chinna da chinna or a vata tukula the suri ke da muriyadu. There's something unique that happens during the film. Like we are we are all not making films. The film happens, and uh, sometimes agla or some magic happens, and there is one or perfection that occurs while making a film. So adi correcta click ka gumbo the. Obviously, it, it reaches the right places, right, right festivals, global audience. We are appeal out of it. This is a regional sector of audience. Mutter lama globally, yar pata le yendu oru baashe thiriya do oru arthla pata on. And the film language or the strength and the kind of movie it is, the adoriya oru originality and uniqueness takes it further. And the and the mari oru vishe in the film le irikaran alada in the film oru Oscars. Varikum pora di kana tadiri aran. मंडे <laughs> Mandela was excellent. One of the best films of late. Mandela, the Tamil la, our screenplay, the way the film was done, casting, all departments, leave me on the extraordinary film. Okay, okay, let's go. Uh, welcome, guys. Welcome and thank you for coming for our screening of last film show, Chello show in uh, Chennai. We're super excited to be here. Um, the film's journey started uh, at a beautiful festival called Tribeca, which is hosted by Robert De Niro in New York every year. Um, we were lucky enough to be invited for an in-person screening on the Hudson River. Um, at the festival, we won the runner-up Audience Choice Award, which is great for us because, as filmmakers, the most important thing for us is what the audience believes and what the audience perceives. Um, after that, the film has won multiple awards, including at uh, the Seminchi Vala Dolit Film Festival, where we won the Best Film Award. Uh, the last time an Indian film won there was about 40 years ago with a film by Mrinal Sen. Yes. Um, we won awards at Busan uh, and in um, Mill Valley. in Mill Valley in the US. We won an audience award. So. For us, it's a matter of pride that a small Gujarati film like ours, which was made with big heart and with a lot of effort from um, crew that was truly international, has started traveling the world. The film has been acquired by legacy distribution companies like Samuel Goldwyn Films in the United States, Shochiku in Japan, which is responsible for all the Kurosawa and Ozu movies. Um, we have Medusa in Italy, and we have Orange Studio doing global sales for us. Um, for a lot of these companies, it's the first time that they've ever acquired an Indian film, um, and they truly believe that this extremely local story about a young boy who follows his dreams and his passion for cinema has global themes. Um, the film has already been dubbed in about ten international languages and has released in cinemas in Spain and Germany to full audiences. Um, the film comes out on October 14th in India. Uh, it's going to release widely across Gujarat and across the rest of India as well. Um, we're really excited to bring it to Indian audiences because, at the end of the day, 
it is truly truly an indian film um we're very excited that and honored that we've been given the opportunity to represent india at the 95th oscars this year um along with our partner samuel goldwyn films in the us and our friend sales agent orange studio who both have excellent track records at the academy we are excited to put on the campaign and hopefully win a nomination and bring the award home Yes. Yeah. So I think Dean Momai, our producer, have said whatever needs to be said. I just want to talk about the movie. You know, last film show, Chello show. It is loosely inspired from my own childhood while growing up in Kathiawad, which is in Gujarat. And uh, when I was kid, like many of us across India, when I saw my first movie at age of eight or nine year. I fell in love with cinema. I was mesmerized. I was hypnotized, and I wanted to do nothing else but make movies from that day. So while growing up as a kid, we had a gang of kids. You know, we did all kind of mischief. We used to collect matchboxes, color glasses. We tried to build even our own projector, but ultimately we ended up stealing film reels of Amitabh Bachchan and got into police trouble. So all these stories were there. in 2010 and 11 when celluloid 35 mm film disappeared you know that's the time i realized okay maybe there is a story to tell about film indian cinema the celebration of single screen cinema hall and how the digital arrived and the film disappeared so last film show is a i would say an emotional tribute to cinema and also to indian cinema in general so i am really happy to host this screening in chennai uh, because i've been huge fan of lot of tamil film south indian cinema i've been saying since 20 years if you read some of my old writing talking about some of the big stars like superstar rajnikanth and talking about their work it's like look there is a great cinema also happening in south but it's only since few years maybe thanks to the streaming or pandemic now whole of india is discovering the cinema from here across the world i say so let's i hope you all enjoy the film and if there's any question you watch the pony salon you watch the pony salon ps1 have you watched yes. oh not yet i'm so sorry it's the movie i'm dying to watch <laughs> it's uh, i would love to watch it because we've been busy doing the campaign with the movie we had a show in kerala we just flew here this morning you know we have a uh, show in mumbai then ahmedabad so but it's the uh, the moment i get a little bit of time go to watch ps1 are you interested in the watching movie are you interested in watching movie oh yeah of course i i watch all kind of films i think many people might know here that i've been watching film from south and tamil since 20 years <laughs> you read the book sir Pony Salman, have you read Pony Salman book? Ah, uh, no, I haven't read the book. No, I've not read the book. But I know about the book and the storyline. Yeah, I know the comic version of it. Okay. Uh, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.